and welcome back to Western Wild. This will be episode 58. I am currently selling methane that we were maxed out on. Um, it's a pretty good price, actually. I sold all of our other stuff that we had going on. Um, we're getting ready to do the late file harvest which is basically just those two cotton fields. In between, I planted um, cover crops in all the fields. And I planted the grass down here in the cow egg field. So, I think we are good to go. I got, um, I kind of sorted out the farm a little bit, too. I think this can probably stay here. Let's, um, Let's put a little bit of gravel behind this. I was trying to do something with that. It didn't quite work out for me. And yeah, we'll put a little bit of gravel back here. And extend it out this way just a little bit. So square that up. I'll probably square this up too, just a little bit here. Looks like that. Okay. So we'll park this back here. Uh, next month we'll probably be cutting them trees up there. I don't know if this tanker can pull. Um, like milk and stuff or not. But I'm going over here. Let's see. I, I rearranged the shed. So this is now going to house all of our field stuff. Like our and then this is our tractors minus this because I mean it can't go anywhere else the bigger stuff's in here but I thought it just looks better that way um, this of course is going to be the harvesters I've already kind of cleaned them up and set them in here for the winter but yeah, let's go down here and get this um, cotton harvester going. And then I will go back and start on that other one. I'll have to do it, mostly. The first part of it, anyway. Him off on a helper, and we'll get in this one, and we'll kind of get um, turn it on. We'll kind of get this little round end right here knocked out after I do a headland or two, and then we can. Uh, We can set this off on a work or two, and I'll be time lapsing it. So, these allergies are absolutely killing me. Yeah, this will be our last harvest of the year. Like I said, I sold. I think I sold everything that we had going. So, that will mean. Um, that's why we're up to 8.3 million now. 
and I need, I still need to look into that uh, lumber production thing, or the log production, whatever it is. And we can get that going on, uh, that way we don't have to worry about cutting trees so much and stuff, you know? I mean, we got plenty to cut, and we can do that now, like next month and stuff in the winter. I will probably also be selling silage next month. This will knock us headling out, and then I'll cut out that little corner up there, because of course the idiots can't figure that out. <laughs> I got grass planted down here, so now we do not have to worry about ever planting that again. <laughs> we just have to worry about fertilizer and mowing it once or twice a year. But it's better than having to worry about planting it and everything else, you know. Actually, I can probably set him off now. We can go look at that. We might need to put some... Uh, Um, lime on it before too long. Well, yeah. I thought I had it uh, going. It's our first bale out of this field, I think. Oh, we had 21 bales, by the way, on that field. Okay, so I'm going to start the time lapse, and I will see you when we get done. Shouldn't be too long.
All right. So we got this field done. I'm pretty sure we can't um, put the cover crop in here. Pretty sure. I'd like to be able to fill this one up if there's any left over here. If there's not, then well, I guess we won't. <laughs> I think we're going to get one trailer load and sell this cotton. I don't know when the price is best for cotton. So we may hold on to it. But the clothing factory is full and I put some in the warehouse up there. So I know we, we're we good on cotton for a while. I mean, we're going to have to be for a year anyway, you know what I mean? It would appear that this field may have enough for me to get this one full. I don't know how many bales we got on this one. I don't really remember how many we had down there either, to be honest. I counted them at one point. It's like six or seven, maybe. Oh, yeah, we're going to have enough to fill this one up. That's all I want, just to fill it up. go up to the end here as long as we can fill this up I don't know what I did <laughs> don't have a clue what I just did but I just want to fill this one up and be done. Right, we can go a little bit faster. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten up here. I don't know how many we had on that other field. I see ten right there for here, so I guess that's a plus. get this one we get this one filled I'm gonna go pick up the truck and come down here and uh, load them up and we're getting kind of close now I don't know how much goes into this before it transfers down there, so I'm not going to mess with it. Um, fold this up, which makes it super long. <laughs> While I'm thinking about it, I'm going to move this up here. Stick this one right here. We will go not there. <laughs> we'll go uh we'll probably spray this one off and get it some gas or diesel, whatever. Fuel is the better word I do believe. Got here bird. Um Yeah, we'll uh, I will get the truck, which is over here actually, and we'll go down there and load those up. I don't think, like I said, I don't think I can plant. No, I cannot. I can plant it in March, 
but also in March I can plant uh, actually nothing else because these two fields are going to be soybean. Well, no, that one's going to be corn. It just take a month for the oil sea radish to um, be ready. Eh. We'll just wait and we'll put corn. We're going to put corn in several places. Up in here. And that field down there. This is going to be soybeans. That's going to be soybeans. We just won't have a cover crop in them. We'll park this up right here. Alright, go get the truck. Get it to fuel. Probably wouldn't hurt to buy another truck. Got three, but it seems like I'm always missing one somehow. Like I always need one. Cut the corner. Um. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna go big on corn and soybeans next year. I think that's gonna be our two biggest thing. <laughs> Of course, we gotta get oats. Oats will be in the field back there and the other field. Just because we need oats for flour. But the corn, we're just gonna sell. Oh, my trailer is up here somewhere, probably at the warehouse where I left. Uh, Where I left it, yep, there it is. Uh, is that the front or is that the back? I can't tell. I think that's the front. So is, when is cotton the best to sell in March? I mean, it's not too far off now. But we can throw it in here. Ain't no big deal. This trailer is weird, too. Like, I don't know why. It's just weird. We'll get that to working next month. It's over there somewhere. Kind of need to work on these other fields. If I could stretch that field out as far as that one, or maybe even combine them, nah, that's been too big. <laughs> I need some smaller fields. Okay. I need some, uh, just different size fields. Like, this one's long but not wide. This one too. That one's wide but not too long. I know where's massive, so is the other one. This one's kind of fun. I call it the fun field because it's just, you know, odd shaped. Alright, so is this ready? I guess this picks it up now. Yes, sir. Alright. I almost want to sell these, but we'll save it till March. We got the warehouse for a reason, I guess. I was looking. I may put something back in there. Like, if I could run another field all the way around through there with corn, whoo, we would be in corn heaven, right? You know, for these to be 10,000 liters a piece, this is quite a bit of cotton out of this little field right here. Now you think about it, it's not a huge field. And we're getting what, there's five, six, seven, eight, nine and a half. 
that's pretty good for this little field here. I think we can haul 11. Yeah, we can make that all corn back there. I think this is going to be our corn section here. Yeah, I'll look into that. That might be a maybe in two year project. <laughs> I mean, we've expanded pretty good everywhere we went to expand. What is wrong with my building? A little spotty there, it looks like. This one's about done. I mean, I could cultivate this, I guess. Get it ready. But then that would mean we'd have to rock pick, and I do not feel like picking up rocks on these bigger fields. This field could actually be expanded out that way. I may look into that, just a little bit of an extension. And look how these line up. One, two. Alright, so three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen bales off this one. Just off this field. That's insane. <clears throat> we'll put all these in the uh, warehouse for now. I don't know how far that one's got to go. I'm getting another bale. We may have 15 off that one, so we have 15, then we had, what, 6 down there? Or 9? No, we had 9. 25? 25 bales total. Off these two fields, we had 20... I want to say 21 on the big field over there that we did. So what, 46 bales total of cotton off three fields? Pretty good. We're gonna store it up and wait until the price is ready. So I have to make two more trips, probably. Alright, so that. See, it does this sometimes, and then sometimes it won't. So I don't never know what what it's gonna do. Come on, let me turn. Last time I done this, it it did not do this. So I like it better when it does this. All right, lower. Okay. I don't know how much that warehouse will hold, to be honest. It's been a long day. <laughs> I know it's just 12, but I mean, we started early. Just to be working in two fields, you know. I hope that got the uh, little patch I left. I hope, anyway. We're just gonna cut right through the middle of the field. I don't think there's any more bales in the field. Now we should pick them up when we drive by. This is why I said this trailer is so finicky. Like sometimes it works, sometimes it don't. Yep, it's working. Okay. I bet money I have to make a second trip just for like one bale. If that's the case, we're selling whatever's left over after we fill this one up. 
too. Okay, we'll sell them too. Looking good though. Now watch, if I go up here and position myself to where it would auto unload like it did just a second ago, it won't do it now. I don't know why it does this stupid stuff, but it just does. A lot of cotton. I'd say our cotton harvest for this year was a very well, a very good success. <laughs> we put it in three fields so we can do the same with uh, soybeans, but we're not going. Well, no, we're just going to put it in two bigger fields. Um, we're just going to rotate cotton and soybeans in those fields. That's what I'm going to do. Um, and then corn and some of these others and oh it did it okay cool those in there this is a 323,980 oh uh, I don't know if that's right or not how is that right for 10,000 a piece and we brought 22,000 up there we gained a thousand somewhere I'll take it, but it make no sense. And I've got, I put one in the close uh, thing there, one load. There's 200,000 liters in it. We're gonna sell these two. Just because, no, 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 we're gonna take them back up there. Got to take trailer up there anyway. We'll wait as bad as I want to. We will wait. I think we're gonna cut those little section of trees down right there. It don't look like much, but it's probably a lot more than it is. And then we can uh, that just gets us a little bit of uh, log production going. I gotta get on Mod Hub and get that mod for the lumber, or the trees, or whatever it is. could put it no I'll put it over there I'm gonna say I could put it up there in that corner but no so how much does this have in it? oh we can fold it oh my god y'all have no idea how bad I've wanted to fold both of these harvesters it's the last two or three times that we've done it it worked out perfect. Guess we'll spray this one off too. And then we'll put them in the second building there and we'll be good. One of these, I think it's that one with the two on it, we bought used at half price when we really didn't have the money. And it is really paid off for us. I think we got one of those harvesters over there too for half price. Can't really remember, but but yeah, they're both folded. That is awesome. Let's get this cotton up there, and then we'll come back down here and spray those off, park them, and call it a day. How about that?
fields, I guess, will just set burning until I can plant something in them. Can't put cover crop in it right now. So. But it will be springtime before you know it. trailers and beat them. Swing a little wide here. I bet. I actually got a few things we can sell but we're going to hold off. Now see? Right there it done it. Park this trailer right here because there's nothing else I'm gonna be putting in here for now. Like it's a little straight. I done it, but whatever. Okay. So you know what? Let's just load up everything we got right now. So well, we got a minute. I think I do enough time lapses that we can do some things like this. Just load it up. Can't be much of it left. I've done this once already today. Push me up the side. Quite a bit, actually. So, but it just keeps going. Three more of these. Come on, spawn. Spawn. Alright, got that. Maybe not everything, but we'll get quite a bit of stuff out here. We'll try anyway. We're not gonna um, go overboard on things. Yeah, seven more of these. So maybe it ain't gonna be too bad then. Three more. Well, I say added in a couple since it looked as fast as it runs. Come on. It's difficult for those last three or four or whatever, you know what I mean? Not right, cat tree things, there's just three of them. Okay. Um, bowls. Next. We're running out of lumber for planks, I know that. Why do you do that? I never understand why it moves it. Like it ain't even touching that down there. It's up here. But it moves all them down there. So stupid. <laughs> Idiot. Watch it. It'll probably shoot them everywhere when I... No, it didn't. And why... Some of them like will take all the way from the bottom up and then the rest of them like, no, no, screw that. <clears throat> we got to wait till the one that's under us goes first. So stupid. Need some more bowls, I guess. So we can go get some whatever over here, tables I think. Here on, yeah, a couple tables. And then whatever's over there in the, uh, looks like doors. I'm sorry, it looks like doors. Uh, whatever's over here in the barrel factory thing. 
barrels and bathtubs and buckets. Oh my. Probably it here. Yeah. Um, get the bread. We'll get the bread. That should be it. Anything else is fine. We're just gonna leave it because. here all day just collecting one at a time or something. Our flowers out. We've got to get some oats next year. I think that one field pretty much done it for almost a whole year. So well when we still got enough to run bread throughout so um I don't think it's too bad. And we'll have two fields this time of it so I think we'll be okay. See now it's working like it should. Alright, that's not too bad today. Now we'll finish it by spraying these off. Come on there, dude. Pull you up. Spray them off a little bit. I don't think these headers detach. At least not all here. Yeah, a little spray spray. And I'll clean it up. Because it will be a whole year before we use these again. Come on, let me through. Yeah, we won't use these until uh, year nine, probably. So we'll park this one this way and the other one will probably break now. Well, let's hit the side of the dang building. How about that. I do need to buy another uh, corn header, I do believe. If we're going to run corn. Now, is this out the way? Oh, yeah. Plenty of room. parked up and we will call her a day. Yeah, I missed that thing there, but it's not like we, uh, we're using it anyway. Yeah, we'll go out this way, I guess. Alright, so that's done it. What is wrong with my building? Like the camouflage or something. Anyway, I think that's going to do it for today. I get That's our fall harvest done. And we will, um, next time we will probably be cutting those trees down right there. And loading up our lumber mill. And I'm, I'm going to try and look as soon as I get off here. And this field still is not fertilized. And I don't understand why. Maybe when it grows I can do it or something. I don't know. But, um, I think... What we're going to do is I'm going to try to look for that mod. I need to fix this. Uh, I need to fix this while I'm in here. Now it's 
good to go after a five thousand dollar part. Um but yeah what I think we'll do is cut the trees. I'm gonna look for that mod. Then we won't have to worry about the trees here and there. But and that's in December, January. I think we'll have some other stuff we can do as well. But we'll just see. We'll play it by ear. If we have to plant cover crops or whatever and then plant our real stuff later on. We'll see. But I appreciate you watching and I will see you next time.